the paved pathways and well-lit streets, Outer Ring is an oasis of commerce, culture and artistry. You are a rapper? Yes. It's able to share more. Ah. Elisa Van Sundegwa is perhaps a true representation of the latter. The young man hopes to become the country's latest breakout music star and perhaps the estate's pride and joy. Ati uli dance kwenye party, haikutosha uli kata kamaji, na kamoshi uli washa kijiti. Elisa Vanson moved here with his parents back in 2009 and he'll be the first to tell you the transition wasn't smooth. Not if you're relocating from high-end state house estate in Kilimani to a less flamboyant Eastlands estate such as Outer Ring. The social cultural shock once forced him to run away from the estate. <laughs> That was your first time. Some come in and but now many youth have embraced the area as home, choosing to associate themselves more with the Eastlands kind of lifestyle than ever before. This has been my life changing area. Really? Yeah, because why so? uh, where, where we used to stay, nilikuwa babi. Eh, tukakavuku sasa, tuka show your life vile inakuanga, yani unajua. Saa, eh, hey, kadi change sana, unajua sana. Babi umeisha sasa? Ikaisha, nilikuwa na overflow, ha? Na socks, na nataki in trouser. Eh, eh, tayo, nilikuwa na chongolewa kila saa. It humbles you when you're coming from Islam. You don't have pride, first of all, because you know where you're coming from. There's no flashy, flashy things here. There's nothing flashy. Yeah, it really humbles you. Mm. Yeah. Does it? Is it a nice environment to prepare you for the future and the outside world? Uh, yes, because there's family. Everyone knows everyone. So there's that unity. Is that you need that's what you can say. Uku in a in a race in a nature talent. Juku no kuna experience ile ya ya kuna experience mzuri na mbaya. Mm. Lakini si mbaya sana. Yaani itakuteach. Ita so utakuwa na kitu ya kupeleka huko nje. So lazima ujue kuji nini. Tena bado tuna tunakonga na na nini na like the people we associate with they are good people so mtakuwa na character mzuri. It is that philosophy that has led entrepreneurs like Rebecca Wairimu Mwangi, who runs this hardware store within the estate, to set up base here for over a decade. You know, we are more as like a family or like relatives. Since we share the same things, we go to the church together. We, we like me, I'm a Roman Catholic, so we have the Jumuiya. Uh, when we, we have things like funeral, we share together. When we have weddings, we share together. So it's more or less like family. Like family. <laughs> yeah. But the sense of community that thrives here is now seemingly under threat. This occasioned by sporadic insecurity issues that often dog the rather quiet neighborhood. Altering has been a safe place apart from now. Now we have started experiencing a few cases of insecurity here and there. Mugging, maybe at the bus stop. This motorbike uh, muggers who will smash your bag or on your way to work. Like before we could come home even late and you are not afraid. But these days it's not very safe. It's not like before. 
Some blame the insecurity issues to the growing number of estate shops and stalls that dot every corner of the estate. What, what if somebody says then why not set up these shops in town? Why must it be within the estate? Because of um, the rent, you know, like now the rent one would pay in town. The commuting, the matter to fair, the, like now you know the fares have gone up. So when we do our businesses here, yeah, we feel that we have cut our expenses here. Yeah. Still, not many are deterred. You see, Outer Ring remains one of the estates still using the old piping system that still has a steady flow of water supply in the area. The most important thing is that we constantly have water. No problem, no water problem in this estate. Mm. Up to today. Up to today. But the Achilles heel in the East otherwise tight-knit social fabric is one concern threatening to cause disharmony among the residents. The residents tell us the upsurge in the number of churches within the estate has come with a fair share of discomfort. Every other hundred meters there is a, ch a church, small ones. Mm -hmm with small congregation of 10, 15, but they have very, very heavy musical equipment and public address systems, such that um, sometimes the vibrations coming out of them will set off car alarms. Yeah, it's, it's very some heavy. serious it's noise, Very eh? serious, yeah. And I think unnecessary because uh, we are getting a small crowd of Members of congregation of noise. But we didn't take their word for it. We decided to visit the estate on Sunday. We are true to the residents' claims the churches had gone all out. From the shopping center to the street corners every church was as loud as they could get some hymns renting the air just meters from residential houses i have mentioned this to the chief and some of the church leaders have been summoned by the chief i've also talked to nema National Environment, uh, whatever it is, authority. So, yes, they have come and talked to some of the churches, but um, nothing much has changed. And as the melodies continue to be belted out, the number of churches within the estate continues to grow. Still, Outer Ring Estate, which was the first estate built before the construction of Buruburu Phase 1 was started in 1970, remains stubborn to the change witnessed within the neighborhood. Sa uku utapata experience ya life ile ikotu wapu katikati. Uweze mani ile poa kabisa na uweze mani mbae. So you get like to feel both sides, both the sides, good exactly. and the... Yeah. So no no utakone utakuwa like atili yako itakuwa itakuwa extended kuna mm -hmm. realize vile watu huko hivi wanaishi na utaweza kuishi na kila mtu tuseme usote siku moja hautaumia mm -hmm. eh, sana hautaumia utaseme usote uende uhamie place nyingine iko chini kabisa so utaweza kuishi nao tuseme upate do uende place nini so utajua na utajua vile life inakuanga huku utakamkokoleana mm -hmm. kweli eh, kweli kabisa so unaona utaweza kusaidia watu is it a good place for a young person? You know, their estates are different. Kuna places yeah, yeah, yeah. in estates are retirement, <laughs> kiwa mze, ishi uku, yeah, I know, in I estate know. ya family, I know, in I estate know, ya mamijana. Outa ring ni estate ya kinanani? Which demographic of people? Demographic right now is from... It's transition, transitioning, sorry. Mm. From 18 to 45. Mm -hmm. The old guard have gone home, mm. retired, left the houses to the children. To the children. The children have married, 
now there's an influx of new people in their state. Mm, that's a blatant. Indeed, for the older generation of residents like Mzega Shanja, Outer Ring has been the best version of a retirement home that they can ever think of. We can kill a wiki. Aki miss and I feel hakufiti. Aki why and I feel hakoseti. To the younger ones, like Elisa Vanson, the estate is a fertile ground for nurturing artistic talent and shaping character and worldview. Yet to traders like Rebecca, the neighborhood couldn't be a much better place to set up shop. Since I live among them, somehow I understand their needs. So what I bring is what they need. Basically, outer ring is like an oyster to the residents here. Whatever suits you well, you can find here. It's part of the fabric that makes the estate stand out at a time where many similar old estates would have otherwise been obliviated. I'd ask for somebody who's lived here for that long, mm. what is it that outer ring estate is offering that no other estate would offer you to warrant you to live here for that long? Well... Rent is an issue because it is affordable. Number two, transport-wise, this area is, communication is quite good because if you were in town and you are using public transport, you'll get transport to this place as late as one or two o'clock in the morning. At the same time, if you want to leave this estate, for errands in town very, very early, like going to the market, you can live here as early as 4 a.m. We have uh, most of the basic needs, like schools. We have good schools around, like the primary school. We have Bruburuan, we have Nairobi, Nairobi River. If it is the issue of hospitals, we have good hospitals around. We have the SOS. We have the city council. There's one here at Cario Bangi South. The, I mean, some, yeah, yeah, the social amenities, not only social as such. Um, the, the needs that a human being really needs. We, uh, somehow we feel that we have them not very far away from us. environment <laughs> Since my parents were to as a money, was a money on the poke, the poor appear to evolve gas, it paid Julie Kane for Mark. Was it was a Mazena that after Natafta Keja outa? We are better than you found. We are better than we found it. Yeah, so you know, Kenya Mina Taka Fanya. For area code, I am Timothy Otieno.